Do you see Harvard, MT, and Penn State saying calls for genocide? Well, why you are surprised? I mean, my friend, those are liberals. Liberals always, they, they are awkward. Now you notice? It is one thing about them is, is, is not awkward and weird and upside down. Why you are surprised? Those people, they hate their own country. They hate American flag. They burn American flag. <laughs> Why do they want to burn the Jews? I mean, they burn their own country. Those are the druggy hippies, mentally ill. So don't be surprised. And they are very aggressive, by the way. They aren't friendly. This is why we as a Christian, we should arm ourselves because time will come and maybe the government will side with them and you need to protect yourself. When Trump, he won the election, what they did? They start burning cars all over in New York, Washington, D.C. Uh, vandalizing stores, stealing, looting. What, what, what election have to do with the store of iPhone? They are gangs. They are not, you know, they claim they are for peace in Gaza, right? But they are the most violent. And we as a Christians, we love peace, but we will not let anyone burn our churches. I will not allow anyone to get close to my house. And we as a Christians, we are very well armed. Don't mess with us. We are very friendly. We, are, we obey the law, but we will not tolerate somebody when to do violence against us. There is nothing that's called far right. I don't know what far right is. You know, the word, those words far right, far left, I find them very uh, framing things, like it's, uh, it's the man who is talking. So, according to somebody, maybe I will be far right. This is how we see me. What those mean? There doesn't mean nothing. Far right, far left. There's no far, there's no close. You know, all left, they share the same ideas. They are socialist communist, confused about their gender, and they think that they have, they are the one who have the best morality, and they think Christians, Jews, anyone, they don't even dare to attack Islam, you know, that's how covered they are, but they think all religions are stupid, except Islam for them, you know, so there's nothing that's called far, it just, like, you know, they say Islamophobe. Well, you speak the truth about Islam, they frame you, they call you Islamophobe. But is, is Islam is a terrorism? Yes. Do Muslims do beheading people? So where is the phobia? Do the government have a checkpoint every airport and they take off your shoes, check your baggage and your luggage, your pocket, they scan you, even they scan your body to be sure there's nothing inside you? All of this because of Islam. And then if you speak against Islam, they call you Islamophobia. So those titles are not real. You have to examine every uh, individual, you know, see what he believes. And if it's a group, well, if they have, a, if they are a party, then the party have, let us say, their own constitution. You check it out, and you can decide where they stand. But for right, far right, for far left, for me, it doesn't count. Left is left, right is right. And if you are a person who is hateful. You are not right, and you are not far right. Like, I don't hate Muslims. I hate what Islam do. I stand against Islam. So if it happened that there is somebody who is a Muslim, is a terrorist, I have no choice but to fight the terrorist. Otherwise, I'm not interested to hurt any Muslim. Same for anyone else. But if you are a person who believe in killing others just because they are different, like what the Muslims do, that is fascism, and that is even Hitler is better than them. But I cannot call them far right. I call it Islam. This is what Islam is about.